What can you tell me about a baseball? I pretty good baseball player back in high school. 270 average. Hot man. Best first baseman school ever had. I was actually talking about a particular baseball. One I found at the newspaper. Small, round, hard, that about it. Can you tell me anything about a free pass to get your clothes pressed? Low Fat give out free pressing coupon many months ago. Big advertisement in newspaper. Nobody use. Do you still honor the coupon? Yes, yes. Forgot to put expiration date on coupon. By now, nobody remember anyway. Must be using coupon for something else. <laughs> what can you tell me about notebooks? Low fat have terrific memory. Not need notebooks. Not know of it. Sorry. How do you like New York? New York too big. Too dirty for me. Good business. Nice place to visit. But wouldn't want to live here. Unfortunately, I do. <laughs> Ever been to the Lion Decker Museum? Of course. Low fat big contributor to museum. Two dollar every year. Some customer also work at museum. Wolf Heimlich, security guard. Very important. Anybody else from the museum ever come here? Yes, yes, let me think. Woman doctor, Greek name. Um, Olympia something. Magellacati Mc... Miklos? Yes, that's it. Olympia Miklos. Not know what she do at museum, but she work there. She and Mr. Heimlich sometime come in together. Have you been there recently? Not been there in, oh, must be almost a year. Whoa, time to send in another two dollar. Besides Mr. Heimlich and Dr. Miklos, are any of your other customers museum employees? Not think so. Oh, wait. How could I forget? Yvette Delacroix. Very lovely lady. She work at museum. Have you ever gone down to the 12th Street docks? You kidding? Docks dangerous place. Crooks and rats there! What can you tell me about Low Fat's Chinese laundry? Look around! You standing in it! Spent any time at the police station recently? Only one time. To report stolen bicycle. Never found. Ah oh well. Do you read the New York Daily Register News Tribune? Seen it. Not read it. Love that not read American newspaper. Too violent. Prefer hometown newspaper. Which is? Newark B. Very good newspaper. Not like most American paper. Has Ziggy been in lately? Ziggy? No Ziggy come in here. Would remember name like that. Sound like good name for comic strip though. Has John Bo been in lately? Not know any John Bo, sorry. Maybe try again with somebody else. Low fat know many people. Who's 
Princess fell a low fat. You joking with me, right? I am low fat. You in low fat Chinese laundry. I knew that. Does a man named Crod fall a T rhubarb come in here? Yes. Remember man with name like that. Extra starch. French cuffs. That all I know. Do you know Detective O'Reilly? Ah, Detective O'Reilly. Very smart man. Funny. No matter how clean I get his clothes, he always looks dirty. Does the name Archibald Carrington III ring a bell with you? Not think so. Very fancy name. Not many fancy people come here. Does the name Pippin mean anything to you? Yes, yes. Pippin Longstocking. My little girl read a book about her. Very funny. Frackles, red hair. I don't think that's the same name. No? I thought it was long stocking. Maybe not. Do you know Sam Augustini? He's the city editor over at the New York Daily Register News Tribune. Sam Augustini? Ah, yes. 17 collar, 52 inch waist, muesli soup and sweat stain. Ring around Kala, nice guy. So you do the laundry for Dr. Olympia Miklos? Yes, spooky lady, all black clothes. She nice, but scary. Do you know Yvette Delacroix? A small smile flickers over Low Fat's normally inscrutable features. Why, uh, why are you smiling? Low Fat have arrangement with a vet. Laundry for free. And what do you get in return? Once more, Low Fat seems to smile slightly, his eyes refusing to meet yours. Is it something private? Low fat not one to kiss and tell. Now sad, okay? I won't tell anyone. I'm sure whatever it is, I've heard it before. He whistles an unrecognizable tune and deliberately looks away. Tell me about Wolf Heimlich. <laughs> What's so funny? Nothing. Wolfie funny. Funny man. Take himself very seriously. Stand up straight. Act like soldier. What else can you tell me about him? Occasional bloodstain. Never sweat. Very tidy. Only see him once in a while. No thank you. Low fat not like corned beef. Prefer more traditional Chinese cuisine. Is baseball nice signature? Bob Ruth. Who boy. Some right hand on that guy. Too bad no have right arm. He's psychiatrist now. I thought maybe this was something you could use. Do I look like baseball player to you? Not play baseball since high school. Average 270. Not bad for 98 pound weakling. <laughs> Can you tell me anything about this notebook? Hmm. Ink stains. Very bad. This not come clean. You better buy new notebook. Ah, yes. This certificate good for free pressing. You keep, you may need low fat press clothes for you sometime. This 
looks like a vase similar to, but slightly different from, the vase on the right. This looks like a vase or an urn of some sort, similar to the one on the left. What's your name, little boy? None of your beeswax. You're quite the impertinent little boy, aren't you? Yeah, well, my folks told me not to talk to strangers. His name's Paul Untermeyer. Yeah, but we call him Stinky because his initials are P.U.